Hello, my name is Blaise Pasquale, and today you will learn how to get involved in undergraduate research. I have worked in the Cabrillon lab in the Department of Pathology for a little bit over a year now. We focus on the biology of aging. The first thing you want to do when you're looking for an undergraduate research position is ask your friends and classmates about their own involvement in undergraduate research. It's the easiest way to get in because they may be able to refer you to their own lab or they may know of an availability in another lab. As a side note, success in college is greatly enhanced by making connections and building your network, even for STEM majors, so keep that in mind. Now, if you don't have any connections, I've narrowed it down to four simple steps to get involved in undergraduate research. Step one. Research the different labs that are available at your university and find one that interests you. Google is going to be your best friend for this one. You're going to want to search up research lab and insert the name of your school at the end of that. You're going to want to check to see if your school has any resources for students looking for research labs. They may have a list of labs that are looking to hire and you didn't even know about it. Step number two. You're going to want to visit the web page for that research lab and skim some of the current literature that has recently been published by that lab. By skimming through some of their recent publications, you'll be able to see if their research is something you're actually going to be interested in. Step number three, email the lab principal investigator. Focus on demonstrating a strong interest, a basic understanding of the research, and include your CV. You want to have a win-win vibe in your email. For example, if your goal is to get into a paid research position, offer to volunteer for free for maybe just one quarter, and after that quarter, you can consider trying to get that paid position. You rub my back, I'll rub yours. Step number four, interview well. Around a week after you send that initial email, you'll get an email back from the PI asking when you're available to interview. You're gonna to wanna to show up to that interview early so you don't get lost in the building. Dress nicely, but don't try too hard. You don't need to wear a tuxedo. Your clothes don't matter. What matters is you show up with confidence and a desire to work in that research lab. You're also going to want to have some questions prepared about maybe something you didn't understand in the research or the types of duties you will have when you're working as an undergrad. Now, here are some other tips. You may have to apply to more than one lab. I know people that had to apply to 10 before they got their first interview scheduled. But don't give up hope. If you're unlucky, you can also apply to the research labs at other universities too. So that's always an option. And there you have it. You now know how to get into an undergraduate research lab. I wish you the best of luck. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.